Hey everyone, Sean here from Simple Texting. Today I'm going to run through a demo of a few key features to get you up and running with Simple Texting. Let's start by creating a keyword. To do this, simply go Add Keyword and choose a keyword that works for you. I'm going to select Treats. Now people who text in Treats will automatically be added to a list. When you select a list that you'd like to add your subscribers to, then you can write your auto confirmation message. This is the message the customer will get back when they text treats. Write a message welcoming new subscribers, provide some information, or even an incentive for signing up. You can also include a link to your website here. Use our fancy built-in link shortener to save some characters too. Below the auto confirmation message, you'll see the free compliance message. You can see a few more details about triggers and additional parameters in our dedicated keywords video. Click save and your keyword is instantly active. Go ahead and give it a test by texting your keyword now. Next, we'll take a look at subscribers. On the subscribers page, you can add subscribers in a number of different ways. Contacts are sorted in your account by lists. You may have as many subscribers or lists as you need on simple texting. First, let's create a list to store your contacts. Give it a name that will identify with the group. Then click save. Now you can add subscribers manually by clicking the add contact and filling out the details here. At minimum, you need to have the telephone number. Remember, you need to select a list to add this contact to. Once you've entered the details, just click Save. You can also import customers from a CSV or Excel spreadsheet, as long as you have their express consent to send them text messages. Just click on the Import Contacts button, select your file, choose the list you'd like to add them to. Below the list you'll see the free compliance message. We send a best practice compliance message to the contacts that you import. Agree to the terms and conditions and choose next. When importing contacts, you can choose to add more than just a phone number. It's important that you've set up your file with a header row so you can easily map the fields. Here's what it should look like. Once you've mapped your fields, just click import. Let's send a message to our VIP customers, letting them know about a special deal just for them. To do this, go to campaigns on the left and choose new campaign. Let's give the campaign a name so we can track the results later. I'm going to call this September VIP Offer. In the message body, you can write whatever message you like to your customers. We also have the option to insert custom fields. When using custom fields, you need to make sure that you either collected the information using our data collection feature or uploaded it with your contacts in a spreadsheet. If you have the custom field set to a first name, this message here, for example, might read, Sweet treats, thanks for being a loyal customer, Sean. Show this text for 10% off your order. You can also upload images into your text. It will show as a link, or on some devices, as a preview image directly in the message. You can use our built-in link shortener here too. We'll track clicks on the link, so it's a great way to track how well your message performs. You can also send an MMS message, which displays images, video, or audio files directly in the message. This is a great way to get your message across visually and can have a big impact on performance in some industries. Have a look at the preview here on the right. You can see what this message might look like. You'll notice the image is directly in the message. It's worth noting that MMS messages are three credits versus a single credit for an SMS. MMS also allows you to have 1600 characters versus 160 characters with SMS. When you're ready to send a message, simply click the list or lists you'd like to send it to and click next. You can send a message immediately or schedule it for a later date. Simple texting also allows you to have a two-way conversation with your customers via the inbox and view responses to your campaigns. You can respond to any message or start a new conversation. When you want to send your message, simply click Send SMS. For some more advanced but still simple to use features, click on the Apps section. If you'd like more information or need some guidance on how to use these apps, simply click on the Help section on your dashboard. The Help section on the Simple Texting website has more detailed breakdowns on all of the steps I've covered. For more help getting started, we're available by phone, email and live chat. So please reach out to one of our amazing support and onboarding reps. When you're ready to upgrade, you can do this by clicking on the green Upgrade button on the dashboard or by visiting the Billing section by clicking on your name in the bottom left. Thanks for joining me and have a great day.